all FCS parents, hope you guys have had a great week. Uh, it's been the longest four day week ever here at Fairfield Christian School. It's just been a strange week overall. Uh, we've had uh, a lot of kids out, by the way. Uh, thank you for that. Not, not, I'm not thankful that they're sick, but thank you for keeping those kids home if they are sick. Uh, it makes a huge difference here on campus. Make sure people stay as healthy as possible. We've also had a lot of staff out this week for various reasons. Uh, some due to sickness, but some due to other reasons as well. Uh, so uh, we've had subs in and other people covering various things. So it's been kind of a crazy week in regards to that. It's just made for a very long week. I myself was out one day this week, not feeling so well. So um, it, it's just made for a difficult week. But we're to the end of the week. It is Thursday and the week is now over. And that's because uh, I've got three things I want to discuss today. The first one is tomorrow. That's Friday, November 11th. No school. No school tomorrow. So don't bring your kids. There will be nobody here. It is Veterans Day. We want to celebrate and honor. If you're a veteran, thank you for your service. In fact, I gave all the kids homework this weekend. They are all to find a veteran and thank a veteran this weekend. Um, it's uh, because of the sacrifices of men and women in this country that we have the freedoms that we have today. We want to make sure we honor and respect those individuals and thank them for their service, especially. We should do that every day, but especially on a day like Veterans Day. So no school tomorrow, Friday, November 11th. Next, number two, Thanksgiving break. That is November 21st through the 25th. Those are normally Monday through Friday. That's a school week, but no school the 21st through the 25th. Uh, Thanksgiving break so I know everybody's looking forward to that in fact next week will probably be difficult to keep the kids focused because they'll all be looking forward to the break but we'll do our best to make sure that they are focused because I know on high school side we've got a lot of work to do before we get to Thanksgiving break because when we get back from Thanksgiving break it's only a few more weeks until finals so a lot of work to do we're gonna be keeping them focused next week but 21st through the 25th is Thanksgiving break no school and finally the third and final thing I want to talk to you about today is our Christmas production. We have not been able to do a Christmas production in a number of years, as you know, because of COVID. Uh, but this year, we're gonna be able to do that. So we are very excited to have our first big production of the year. And that's gonna be our Christmas production. And we are doing a Christmas variety show this year. That is gonna be on Thursday, December 8th at 6.30 p.m. at the Building Christian Fellowship in Sassoon. In fact, in the Marina Shopping Center, that's where it's located. 207 uh, Marina Boulevard, I believe, is where it is located. We are so excited to be able to have a production this year. Uh, as I said, we haven't been able to do them in a long time, so I'm hoping for a big one and a successful one the first time out. Uh, for those of you that have been here a number of years, we've done variety shows before. They're always fun and entertaining. It's going to be the same this year as well. If you don't know what that is, every homeroom uh, puts together an act, and they perform that act at the variety show. There could be singing, dancing, acting, uh, comedy. Uh, there, I, know that, I know all the acts are gonna be there. Some of them are gonna be funny. Some of them are gonna be a little more serious. Uh, all of them are gonna be entertaining, but I'm looking forward to a great time. I know students in classes have already been practicing. In fact, today I saw a bunch of, a bunch of 11th and 12th graders running around campus shooting various videos that they're gonna put together for that evening. So I'm looking forward to seeing how that finally turns out. Uh, but it's gonna be a great night. I'm hoping everybody can be there. First of all, I hope all you parents can be there. But more importantly, I hope all your kids can be there because this is a time for them to perform and do things together as a class. And in fact, parents, if you know your child will not be there on Thursday, December 8th at 6.30 p.m. at the Building Christian Fellowship, if you know they will not be there, please make sure your child's teacher knows. There's nothing worse than preparing for a child to be there, especially if they've got an important part, and then all of a sudden them not showing up that evening, and then teachers and the classmates have to scramble to figure out what they're gonna do without that person there. I've been in that position before. I don't like it, I, I don't enjoy it. So please make sure your child's teacher knows if your child is not going to be there that evening. Of course, we want everybody there, students and parents alike. Again, this is a chance to celebrate Fairfield Christian School and everything going on. It's a great entertaining night. I encourage you all to be there. Thursday, December 8th at 6.30 p.m. at the Building Christian Fellowship. Some of you may be asking why we don't do it here on campus. Uh, and while our sanctuary is great for a lot of things, including chapels on Friday, for a production like this, uh, it's just not a very big uh, venue in order to seat a lot of people. Also, uh, the church here does not have any sound equipment, no lights, anything like that. And while we set all that stuff up for chapel, 
Uh, again, it's not optimal for what we want to do in terms of uh, our variety show. So uh, the Building Christian Fellowship has graciously opened their doors. Pastors John and Kaya Butcher have been incredibly supportive of Fairfield Christian School over the years, as have many of our churches. Uh, but we've had events there before and they've gone, on, gone off incredibly well. And so uh, when they opened their doors to us and said, yeah, come on in, we said, fantastic, we'll be there. So that's why we're doing it at the Building Christian Fellowship. It's not too far away. It's just down the road a little ways and it's gonna be a great time, uh, very entertaining. So again, make sure you set your calendars. It's on a Thursday night, which is a little bit different than what we usually do, but I think a Thursday night will work just fine. We'll do it at 6.30. We're trying to start as late as possible to make sure that people are off work, but early enough that when we get done, kids can still get to bed at a decent hour, uh, and then it'll be a great night overall. I don't expect it to go more than an hour and 15, an hour and a half. Uh, we should be able to get the acts in there and get things going, and again, It'll be a great time of the entire Fairfield Christian School community coming together and celebrating these kids. All right, that's all I've got for you this week. I hope you guys have had a great week so far. Hope you enjoy the three-day weekend with your kids. Uh, if you guys, as always, have any questions or anything, please contact, here, contact us here in the office. We'd be more than happy to answer any of the questions you guys might have. All right, have a great weekend. See you guys real soon. God bless.